Hello traders, welcome back to another video. Most of you traders are familiar with the traditional moving average such as the simple moving average and exponential moving average. Many traders rely on them to help get high probability trading entry points and profitable exits. But a well-known problem with the traditional moving averages is the serious lag that is present in most types of moving averages, whether it be simple or exponential moving average. There is another moving average indicator that provides a solution of it by calculating a faster averaging methodology without almost any lag, this indicator is the DEMA or double exponential moving average. In today's video we will take look at this lesser known, but very effective moving average indicator that is called, DEMA or double exponential moving average and we will build a powerful trading strategy. Before we dive deeper, if you are new on the channel, please subscribe to the channel, hit the like button and also hit the notification bell. DEMA was created to find a better moving average study which could reduce the lag of traditional moving average indicators and one that would provide more timely entries. The DEMA indicator is a double exponential moving average indicator which is more responsive to recent price data compared to the traditional exponential moving average study. Since moving averages tend to be lagging indicators, they can generate somewhat delayed trading signals. Let's take a look at this chart and compare the differences between the different types of moving averages to get better understanding of this. Here we have a price chart with the following moving average overlays. The red line represents the 100 period simple moving average line, the green line represents the 100 period exponential moving average line, and the blue line represents the DEMA moving average line. Notice, how the double exponential moving average line hugs the price action better than both the simple moving average and exponential moving average. The double exponential moving average has a complicated formula behind it. Essentially, the DEMA indicator is a combination of single and double exponential moving averages that result in another exponential moving average. Here is the formula for the DEMA indicator. The exponential moving average 1 is equal the exponential moving average of price. The exponential moving average 2 is equal the exponential moving average of exponential moving average. And the DEMA is equal 2 times exponential moving average 1, minus exponential moving average 2. And so, as you can see from the formula above the DEMA takes into account a single exponential moving average, known as exponential moving average 1, and then a double smooth exponential moving average known as exponential moving average 2. And then from here, the DEMA can be calculated by subtracting the exponential moving average 2 from 2 times of exponential moving average 1. Surely, you do not need to memorize this formula to start using the DEMA technical indicator. Your trading platform will automatically plot the DEMA indicator on your price chart based on your specific input. The DEMA trading indicator may appear somewhat confusing and complicated to understand, however, its uses are fairly straightforward. That is to say that many of the signals that you get from the DEMA indicator will work similarly to other more traditional moving average. For example, we can utilize the DEMA moving average line to identify trends in the markets, find areas of support and resistance, spot potential breakout opportunities, and perform other technical-based analysis. Generally, the DEMA moving average line will provide earlier entry opportunities since it is more sensitive and responsive to recent price action. Apart from DEMA, there is also another indicator called TEMA. The TEMA stands for Triple Exponential Moving Average. Do not confuse both of them. Essentially, the Triple EMA utilizes a triple smooth exponential moving average along with the single and double smooth exponential moving averages. There is no need to get into the exact formula of Triple EMA for you to understand that as a triple exponential moving average, it will be even more sensitive to the recent price action than the DEMA. The triple EMA indicator is very well suited for short-term trading due to its more sensitive nature. The DEMA indicator can also be used for short-term trading and long-term trading, however tends to work better for swing trading opportunities. Look at this price chart, it shows both the double EMA and triple EMA indicators plotted on the price chart. As you can see the triple EMA is much more sensitive than the double EMA. Double Exponential Moving Average Signal Types 
As we now know, the DEMA indicator is more responsive to recent price action. And as such, it can often provide signals earlier more than the traditional moving average. The DEMA can provide the following signal types. Trend identification. Trend identification is one of the most important aspects of trading. Without knowing what the current market environment is, it will be difficult to consistently beat the market. Traders need a method for identifying whether the market is in an uptrend, downtrend, or is trading in a sideways, range-bound manner. Although you can often look at a price chart to get an idea of what the general trend of the market is, you want to have a more objective measure for defining the current trend. The DEMA moving average line does an excellent job at providing that information. When the price is trading above the DEMA line, and the DEMA line is sloping upward, then we can say that the trend is up. Similarly, when the price is trading below the DEMA line, and the DEMA line the sloping downward, then we can say that the trend is down. And finally, when the price is trading sideways, and the DEMA indicator appears relatively flat, then we can say that there is no trend in place, or that there is no clear direction currently in the market. Dynamic Support and Resistance Analysis There are many types of support and resistance levels in the market. And the two primary classes in which most support and resistance levels fall into include fixed support and resistance, and dynamic support and resistance. Fixed support and resistance represents levels that are static or fixed based on a particular price level. This includes horizontal price levels. The second class of support and resistance levels, which are called dynamic support resistance levels, include trend lines, moving average lines, and more. These dynamic support and resistance levels can change with each new bar that prints on the price chart. So the DEMA indicator, which is a type of moving average study is considered a dynamic support resistance indicator. The double EMA indicator can be quite useful in finding levels of support within uptrend, or resistance within a downtrend. That is the same that when prices move away from the DEMA indicator to the upside and then pull back towards the DEMA line, that intersection can often create an area of support. Similarly, when prices move away from the DEMA indicator to the downside and then pull back towards the DEMA line, that interaction can create an area of resistance. Trade Entry Mechanism Technical traders can use the DEMA indicator as an entry signal. There are a few ways that this can be accomplished. The simplest method would be to wait for a price crossover to the upside of the DEMA line from below to signal a long entry. And along the same lines, you could wait for a price crossover to the downside of the DEMA line from above to signal a short entry. On the other hand, we can combine two DEMA lines, which consists of one shorter length DEMA line such as the 20 period, with a longer length DEMA line such as the 50 period. Then, wait for a crossover of the shorter 21 line above the longer 50 line to signal a long entry. And similarly, wait for a crossover of the shorter 21 line below the longer 50 line to signal the short entry. Trading Strategy Alright, now we will build a trading strategy that incorporates the double exponential moving average as one of its core components. To make this strategy more powerful and profitable, combine it with different confluences such as price action technical analysis, chart pattern, etc. In this DEMA trading strategy will include two technical conditions. First, we will make a simple price action analysis such as identifying, chart patterns, support or resistance. The second technical condition that we will incorporate into this strategy is the DEMA. In this case we will be used two different DEMA. The first will be the shorter 20 period DEMA, and the second will be the longer 50 period DEMA. By rules. So here are the rules for entering and managing a long position. Step number one identify a bearish channel chart pattern or any other bearish chart pattern. Step number two the 20 period DEMA must cross above the 50 period DEMA. Step number three wait for the price to break and close above the upper resistance line of the chart pattern. Step number four enter a market order to buy immediately following the close of the breakout candle. Step number 5 Place your stop loss just below the previous swing low. Step number 6 The exit signal will occur upon the 20 period DEMA crossing below the 50 period DEMA. Sell rules are the opposite of buying rules. Thanks for watching.
In case you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask in the comments. Please don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video.